welcome to my channel, Patty Puckett Pouring Art. I'm Patty. Today I'm going to try to use all my leftover paints. So I have two, four, six, nine colors here. They're all leftover. Actually, I have ten colors because I have some satin white that I mixed with some turquoise blue. And what I'm going to do, I made sure my canvas was level. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to layer these like a puddle pour, but not in a puddle. I'm just going to put them this way on top of one of another. I don't know if I'm going to get the web effect. I'm going to put down a copper gold first, which is a metallic, and we'll just see what happens. And then I'm going to pour this baby blue around the outside, let it roll over. Maybe we'll get some pearls. We'll see. So just experimenting, trying to get rid of these and hopefully come out with something good. So let's get started. So this is a 16 by 20 canvas um, and this is a copper gold mix. I'll try to get all that out. <clears throat> it. I'm going to try to do just one layer of the colors. I don't need to do more than one. This. Okay. All right, the next, I think, I'm not sure about the colors. I've mixed so many um, I think this is, is an ultramarine mixed with something, so I'm just going to pour that right on top of there. So pro most likely it's a transparent color. Then we got this is like a crimson scarlet, it's a red mixed with orange. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and pour this blue around because it's starting to move too fast, so I'm going to go ahead and do the blue sides. Okay. Okay. All right. Maybe that'll hold it there. This is some kind of purple. Not sure what. Not sure about the mediums that are in it and the colors either. This is some kind of gold and it's mixed with probably I think it's raw sienna. A little bit of yellow left. This is lemon yellow, and it also is a transparent color. I know this is phthalo blue. Phthalo green. And I'm not sure about this one. I do have some sparkles in there, though. Okay. Tons of paint. I'm losing a lot off the sides, but yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start tilting. I do want it to go over a little bit. Let's see what happens. I might do a a wreck on this one. Let me go ahead and pop pop the bubbles first. Okay, I'm already losing a bunch. So I'm going to go one way. It's going to go fast. I want it to roll over that blue. That's what's going to be left here. That. Okay, I'm going to come back this way. I think I just lost a lot of the color, but it's still a bunch here.
I'll be back with you in about, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes. Let's see how it's changed. Okay, not good. So I'm trying to figure out what to do. I have a lot of paint here. I think what I'm gonna try to do is scoop up some, run it across a couple areas and then tilt again. Never done this before. So there's just so much paint here. I just feel so, you know, I just hope I don't make mud. So I'm gonna go here and I'm just gonna lay it on there. mud in a couple areas. This is muddy. This is muddy. Yeah, it's a lot of mud. Okay. Step two. This is a muddy mess. I am going to try and do a swipe over this. So I got different cards. Um, you know what? I'm going to see if I can spray that. I have some silicone here. I can get to it. I haven't been using silicone <clears throat> for a while, but I'm going to go ahead and try to. I'm going to swipe from here down. So I'm going to put the silicone right in here. Okay. like this. I think it's cool. Wow, okay. So never give up. It's so different. I like how the colors are coming through in a couple areas. I like this. It's almost like webbing instead of cells coming up. It's almost like you're looking through a window that's dirty and trying to see to the outside. <laughs> Does that make sense? Probably not. But maybe icicles hanging outside. I'm gonna try to get you to see that. Oops. See? Oops, damn it. That's why I don't like keeping my sticks in there. Can you see? I don't know if you could see that whole thing. Oops. Maybe I'll back it up so you can. <clears throat> there. Now you should be able to see it. Now I gotta fix this. This should be no problem. Yeah, I like it. Hey everyone. Well, it was about an hour and I just didn't like this part especially. 
So I started doing milk paint dots, um, balloon rolls, and adding a lime green color. And I added a little gold. And that's the golden iridescent dots there on the long, long side, the white. Um, so I'm going to try to bring some light colors up. I did a balloon roll oh, about half an hour ago and it just it was still too wet. So now I'm bringing up some color here. So I'm going to go ahead and see what else I can do with this. So I'll speed it up. afraid to go over your your balloon kisses a couple times <clears throat> if you want that lighter color that's underneath to come up that's you know go ahead and do that and you do have to let it dry um, I could probably have let this dry a little bit more but it's if you let it dry it seems to be seems to work a little better. Let it dry maybe an hour depending on how much paint you have on the canvas. So I think this is more interesting than it was before. So I will keep on I'll do something down. Oh, I like that. So now we got like the copper and the orange coming up. There's none of that over here. I don't know how high I want to come. Okay, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna work on the upper part right here for a minute and see what else is going on. Very different. Yep, it's super, super different. Okay, I'm gonna put some milk paint. Dots <clears throat> up here. So I use I use this. Fill it up. It's a pipette. I get all the air bubble out, and then until I start getting paint, and I don't let the air back in. <clears throat> Some people use a popsicle stick, but. <clears throat> You know, I'm thinking, hey, I'm just going to use this. I've used this before. I have some previous videos where I did this. I don't know, probably a month ago. I think it was my injection pores. I'm just going to try to follow this right on down. Part way. You know, the more you squeeze, the bigger the dots are.
think I'll just leave it. Okay, well, I think it looks better than um, it was getting really muddy down here. So, hey, balloon rolls, Dutch pours, um, dots, swipes, you can do all that um, if you have a crappy pour and you don't like it, then you might as well try to fix it. So, thanks for joining me. Look forward to having you here next time. Cheers. Good night.